Welcome back. You're watching News 12. I'm Scott McGee and family and friends are remembering a beloved member of the community. News 12's Nikita Ramos has that story. The beaming voice of an angel, 45 year old Lawrence Broderick was a leader of the church choir at St. Anthony's in West Harrison for well over a decade, a pillar of the parish. I honestly, my life is just not going to be the same without him. A mentor and best friend to Jacqueline Ledesma, a young member of the choir. He really brought you along. Yeah, he really took me under his wing, protected me, protected my voice. Um, inspired me every step of the way when I wanted to give up. Also a teacher at the Immaculate Heart of Mary in Scarsdale, where the grief is heavy among his students and colleagues. Broderick had a contagious love for nature, especially kayaking. It was one of his passions. In fact, he even invited me to go and said, you got to experience kayaking. He said, why don't you come out, get away from everything, relax, and we'll just go kayaking. He sadly took his last ride out on the water Monday night. He tried to kayak from Hempstead, Long Island to Mamaroneck as a nor'easter intensified. The Coast Guard recovered his body near Orchard Beach in the Bronx on Tuesday. His kayak and personal items were found at Glen Island Beach in New Rochelle. But the legacy he leaves behind among the lives he has touched is an inspiration bright enough to light the world. Lawrence is an example of you take your talents and you just give glory to God by using them. You take your life, you give glory to God by living it to the fullest. And he's an example of that. Broderick is survived by his mother and his brother. In West Harrison, Nikita Ramos, News 12.